Hello, I'm going to be doing a monologue from one of my favorite books, Looking for Alaska, and I just found out that, well, I didn't just find out, but I found out a while ago that they're making a movie based off the book, and I'm really excited about that, and it kind of in inspired me to um, do this video. I might not be looking at the camera the whole time. I do not have this whole thing memorized. I have it on my computer, so I probably won't be looking at the camera the whole time. Yeah, so here we go. Best day of my life, January 9th, 1997. I was eight years old, and my mom and I went to the zoo on a class field trip. I liked the bears, and she liked the monkeys. Best day ever. End of story day after my mom took me to the zoo where she liked the monkeys and I liked the bears. It was a Friday. I came home from school and she gave me a hug and told me to go do my homework in my room so I could watch TV later. I went into my room and she sat down at the kitchen table I guess. Then she screamed and I ran out and she had fallen over. She was laying on the ground, holding her hands to her head and jerking, and I freaked out. I should have called 911, but I just stood there, screaming and crying until she stopped jerking. And I thought she had fallen asleep, and whatever had hurt, didn't hurt anymore. So, I just sat there on the floor with her, until my dad got home an hour later. And he's screaming, why didn't you call 911? And he tried giving her CPR, but by then she was plenty dead. Aneurysm. Worst day. I win. You drink. And that was it. Um, I thought I would do a lot better than I did. That came out a lot better in my head than it actually did. Um, out live. I don't know what the words I'm looking for are. It came out better in my head than it did, actually. Yeah, I don't know what I'm saying. Anyway, that was Alaska's best day, worst day. Um, I hope you liked it. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Bye.